morning, everyone. Coming on to share with you some items I've received from N Beads. They very kindly let me spend up to £25, including postage, um, from their website in exchange for, for um, doing some videos with the products that I have, have bought, well, that they've given me. Um, this is about the tenth time I've tried recording this, and I apologise to to Enbeads now because uh, I have had this package a little while, but um, I've just had technical problems. So hopefully this time round all will be well. So the package came in wrapped up in one of the those white plastic um, bags, very strong. And then everything was wrapped in bubble wrap. So uh, let me show you what I got. So I'm just going to move everything to, to the side. So you can see, I have to say that this website is extremely cheap. Uh, it's amazing, an amazing, I don't know how they manage it. And um, they, they, they have um, a warehouse wholesale system on the website whereby when you buy so many of one thing it costs this and then when you if you increase the number it costs slightly less etc so you can up to 15 items you get this uh, this discount and you don't have to buy 15 of one thing it can be uh, um, multiple things but they still apply the discount so that's amazing anyway so the first thing that I got was this bundle of there we are, as you can see, uh, double-sided foam tape. I'm going to give it a try. It seems quite sticky. Um, it's an inch wide and it's about two millimetres uh, in thickness. And there's a metre on each roll and there were nine rolls in the package. And it cost less than two pounds for all of that, which I thought was a bargain, really. Then I got these... Um, hole punch, it's a single hole punch which cuts a hole that size so I th haven't got anything like that of course I use my you know, the normal paper punch that you have put two holes in a piece of paper to make my holes but they're a bit big so I thought this would be good for tags and things like that I then picked up two dies so you, many of you know that I've only got a small die cutting machine so these this is the width of my plate it's about uh, three centimeters wide or is it three inches three centimeters a bit small isn't it <laughs> I think it's three inches let me just see uh, it's two and two and a half centimeter two and a half inches across so I have to be a bit careful with the dies that I get so but this one fits perfectly so there's no problem. This is of a poppy and the total length is three and a half and the, at its widest it's um, one and three quarters of an inch. So um, I'm looking forward to making things with that. The next set of dies that I got, I was a, a bit shocked at how small this was but this is probably my fault for not taking uh, enough notice of the measurements and as everything is in centimeters it's or millimeters even it's a bit hard sometimes to calculate but anyway this is a set of animals so there's a hedgehog so this is the hedgehog these two bits a little mouse and a snail here and a leaf and then there are some eyes here so the eyes for the the three animals and the as I said, it's a bit small, smaller than what I thought it was going to be. But anyway, the, the hedgehog is about an inch square. The mouse from is, a, is an inch high. And from nose to tail is an inch. And the snail is uh, it's about three quarters of an inch. So that, you know, not that bad. So anyway, so I shall come on and do project with those in the near future. Now NBs is of course as you would expect a lot of their website is beads 
and I picked up this bag of multicoloured beads um, which I wanted because all the beads that I've got at the moment are round and small and I wanted something with a bit of texture and a bit of um, different shape really, different things and these are really quite chunky and there, there's some purple, you can see green, gold, blue, and there's violet so I thought these were quite interesting and they're extremely light because they are made of acrylic so um, and because they're so light this bag weighs 500 grams I think and there must be at least 500 beads in here so um, enough to last me a lifetime really I then picked up some other beads now <coughs> excuse me so I have some projects in mind so I want to make some earrings for some friends of mine for Christmas so the first ones I picked up were these and again um, again they're quite heavy so I thought well I'm not going to make these into earrings now I'll probably make them into a chunky necklace with some uh, other beads in between um, so they were those now that these as you can see there are five in a packet so the packet comes as a five and then obviously you can get multiples of five so I then picked up these green ones which are very pretty and they've got a pink holographic um, gem in them as well and silver so, so they will make nice earrings it's a pity there aren't six in the packet but anyway there we go <laughs> I'll have to make a, a dangle or something with the odd ones um, and then these ones so I think these are really pretty as well turquoise these are and they're all quite light apart from those orange ones which uh, are a bit heavy so um so those so those are all the ones and then not quite all the ones in five and i got these sort of lemony green um ones with brown uh, and gold in between So an interesting shape. And then I got some of these purple ones, which again are very pretty. And uh, there are 10 of these in a packet. And the same with these, there's 10 of these in a packet, which um, these are very small, green and gold. You can see that green and gold. And then, Fine. And then I got this string of beads here, which um, each bead, let's see, they give you the dimensions in millimetres, so each bead is it's about 0.8 of a centimetre long, um, and they're, they're like double cones, so they slope down at, at both sides. So. So they're really pretty and, and I bought these uh, with a project in mind as well. And then um, finally from the beads section I got these um, gold, red and green beads. Now these are quite heavy um, and I have a feeling that they came, um, it says four on the packet but I'm not sure if I bought these singly or not, I can't remember. Um, as there's only four in the packet that's uh, why I'm thinking they may have been sold singly and I just ordered four then I looked at, I got some chain for the idea of making some some uh, what are those things called dangles and, and things so this rose gold chain um, this two meters here and I think it's quite pretty it might also look nice for some of the earrings that I'm going to make so well, uh, yes. I've only just sort of got into making jewellery and I really enjoy it so, and everybody in my house is saying oh I've got this, it's broken, can you mend it and it's great to be able to do that rather than having to throw you know things that you like away so 
And then I got these butterfly charms. So they are a centimetre, yeah, a centimetre square. And there's ten of those in the packet. And again, I got these also thinking that they might make nice earrings. I'll have to see as I put things together. Um, I got these little flowers as well. I don't know, maybe you can see them. Again, they are a centimetre in diameter. And I also got these beautiful pink flowers. These are slightly bigger. These are one and a half centimetres in diameter. And I thought they were really pretty. And um, I had a friend in mind to make earrings for her with these. So that's all the beads that I got. Then I got this charm bracelet. So it's a heavy link chain with this charm on it, which is of a musical clef, um, which I had a friend in mind. Um, the thing is that I've got five friends that I wanted to make earrings for and hopefully they are, uh, my idea is to put them in um, Christmas cracker and that hopefully we'll be able to have a party all together, hopefully. Well, it will be a party with a difference, with masks and keeping distance, etc, etc. But, you know, as crackers usually don't have very exciting things in, I thought it would be nice to put a pair of earrings in each one. So that's what all of this is all about. But there's one particular friend who doesn't have pierced ears and doesn't wear earrings anyway, so I thought that this could be quite good for her as a, an alternative. As she is extremely musical, loves playing the piano, and yeah, likes all things musical, and so much so that her mask is that she wears is um, covered in musical notes. So I hope she's going to to like that. So. So that's all the beads. And the last things that I got were some stencils. And again, I didn't, um, I didn't do my measuring very well. Uh, I didn't have my ruler with me when I, um, when I did the order. So again, it is my fault completely. But these stencils are ten, ten and a quarter inches by seven. So they're almost A4 size, as you can see. So that took me a bit by surprise that they were so big. And then the butterfly, this butterfly is five and a half inches across its widest point. So really big, um, really big butterfly. But I think it'll be great. It'll be great. So um, to see how I make something with that. The next stencil I got was this one, which has got roses here and then other flowers. I'm not sure this, this, well, I'm not sure until I, until I work out what it is, but um, this one looks a bit like a hibiscus. This looks like a bit like cherry blossom. So this one size wise isn't too bad, although this, um, this particular stencil is six and a half at the widest point but again you don't have to use the whole thing so hopefully I now I'll be able to make some projects with that and the last one I got is this one which is enormous so this is is um, nearly six and a half in width on the inside and at its highest point is six and a half and I, I love dandelion clocks and everything, so it's why I went for it. But again, I didn't really check the measurements. So I'm hoping I'm going to be able to use this. All the, all the stencils came wrapped in a cellophane bag and then, then in one of those strong um, these bags. So, so each one came in, in these. And then all, everything else also came double wrapped apart from the phone tape that didn't come in a, one of those um, uh, self-sealed bags. But everything else did. Everything was very well packaged. And as I said, the prices are really cheap. So I got all of this, including the postage, which, or the trans, yeah, what's it called? Well, anyway, postage. Um, the postage was about 
six pounds or so. So you can say that all that I've got, I got it for for nineteen pounds maybe. Um, I think it is a, a website that is well worth going to, and they have very kindly given me a discount code for you. So I will list that at the bottom of the of the video together with um, the links to all the various items that I obtained and I would like to thank NBeads for this opportunity to collaborate with them and I will be back in the near future to 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 make some things with the things that I have bought so thank you all for watching and I'll see you all again soon